Hello, today I'm going to show you how to make dotted lines in Adobe Photoshop. First open a new document and let's create a new layer. Now select the brush tool and click on this little arrow to open the brush preset picker. Set the size to 27 and the hardness to 100%. Now double click on the hard round brush. Next open the brush panel. If you don't have it open go to window and select brush or press the F5 key on your keyboard. Now with the brush tip shape selected click on the spacing slider hold and move your mouse to the right. The higher the spacing number, the bigger the gap between the dots. Let's set it to around 119% and close the panel. If you would like to adjust the size of your brush, you can easily do it by pressing down the left bracket key to make it smaller or the right bracket key to make it bigger. And now just click and draw a line. Let's make a new layer. Increase the brush size and pick a different color. Now we will draw a straight line. To do that first click, hold and while pressing down the shift key move your mouse to draw a line. Let's make a new layer. Change the color and reduce the brush size. Now we will draw diagonal lines. To do that click and release the mouse. Then move over here but don't click yet. First press and hold the shift key and then click to make a line. And again click, release the mouse, press the shift key and click again. And so on. Let's make a new layer and move over to the rectangle tool. You can choose any of these shapes. I'm going to select the ellipse tool to draw a circle. First let's select the path from the tool modes. Now click and hold down the shift key to draw a circle. And let's pick a different color. Now select the brush tool, open the brushes panel and let's increase the brush size and spacing. Now switch to the direct selection tool. Right click with your mouse and select stroke path. Leave the simulate pressure box unchecked and click OK. Now right click with your mouse and select delete path. You might be lucky and the space between the dots might be ok. However, in this case the two dots on top are too close to one another. Let's undo it. Now we will use the second method which will give you more control. Select the ellipse tool again. But this time choose shape from the tool modes. And let's draw a circle. Set the shape fill type to none. The stroke to whatever color you want your stroke to be. Next choose the stroke width. And finally set the stroke type to dotted line. Now you have options to align your stroke to the inside, center or outside. Let's choose the center. You can notice that the dots on top are too close to one another. To fix it open the more options dialog box. Click on the gap length window and while pressing the up or down arrow key on your keyboard several times, 
adjust the spacing. Next we'll add dotted lines to a custom shape. Let's make a new layer and select the custom shape tool. Now click on this arrow to open the custom shape picker and you can select any shape you like. I'm going to choose a heart. While holding down the shift key draw a heart. And like before repeat the same process. Change the fill to none. Pick a stroke color. Choose a stroke width and set it to dotted line. Now open the stroke options dialog box. Adjust the gap length and align the stroke to the center. Now I will show you one more way to make a diagonal dotted line. Select the pen tool, pick a color and draw a path. Now switch to the direct selection tool, right click and choose stroke path. Then right click again and choose delete path. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.